everyone welcome back to my bedroom yes i am filming another haul on my channel this is this stuff never happens i never have two hauls in one week but here i am suppressing the odds surpassing the odds bloody hell i've had a full day of uni so i am tired i'm coming at you with a miss pap haul okay i've never really explored miss pap before but i've always seen like anna matilda always wears miss pap tia you know, my OGs always wear this pap and I'm like, I need to try this out. So, this is what I'm going to do in today's video. I have this massive bag. Oh, make sure I don't flash my dress. I have this massive bag and I also have another massive bag down there. Miss Pat gave me free range on their website. So I picked up quite a few things. I can't wait to try them on. So I'm gonna do like a big try and haul, all autumn winter stuff, um, and I can't wait. I'm not gonna lie, I have been wearing some of these pieces already because I was just too excited not to wear these. I mean, it's like Santa when this delivery came. Okay, I just to take a thumbnail and we'll get on with the video. So the first thing I wanna show you that I picked up is this little top, okay. I have been wearing this to death, hence why there's probably a makeup stain around here. And there's probably a fake tan stain somewhere else. I do apologise. But this has been my favourite top at the moment just to chuck on. It's white, cropped, and it's actually a ribbed material. Really nice, thick, not see-through. I've been gravitating towards this top the most because I just chucked it on with everything. Like jeans, blazers. I've dressed it up and wear like a cute skirt with it. Like it is my go-to top at the moment. I do want this in a different colour. But it's just, it's so easy. I am wearing a bra with this because it is, there's a little like elasticated band, but it's not supportive enough not to wear a bra. That makes sense. So I am wearing a bra with this and yeah, I just think it's really cute and flattering. I've actually paired it with these jeans. Okay, just have a look at these jeans. Yeah, and we've got the full force of them. Sorry, my bra is coming through. I've seen these jeans so many times on Anna Matilda's account. I was like, I need them. They just look so cool on her. Like, she styles them so well. And she wears them low rise. But obviously, I'm not going to wear them low rise because I just can't do low rise. But I picked them up regardless. And I'm wearing them high waisted. So they're just like, oh my God, the rain is unreal. Like, I want to go and get coffee later. But I haven't even got an umbrella. So that will have to pass regular like high-waisted blue mom jeans and then they have let me pan you down they have this added detail of like an extra like button so she wears them like this do you know what i mean so that you can there's a little strip of stomach and these actually fit really well i think i got a size 10 in these and they're brilliant they are actually not too long look like when you're wearing your trainers it just looks cooler so I'll try these on for you now. Okay, these jeans fit. Let me pan you down. What am I doing? These jeans, I love. They're a bit baggier and they are much longer. Can you see that? They definitely flop over my foot. So and they're definitely more flary. So if you're small, these would be like your perfect go-to flare. Is it me as I've gone suddenly really dark? Oh yeah, and the detailing. The detailing on the band is like this. It's just like normal jeans like this, but then they've got like an extra like waistband and a button which then buckles like this. Oh God, which is kind of hard to do, but you know, like that. So it crosses over like that and I think it's cool. And then it's got front pockets and then it also has back pockets. Anyway, these jeans I probably wear more in the night time because they are flared and they do drag on the floor. So I'd wear like a cute heel with them, a cute heel with them. So I'd be more like elevated, but I love these. I think, I think I prefer these ones just because they fit a little bit more comfortably than the other ones. These are also size 10 and I don't know. I think this detailing is more flattering than the other detailing. If, if I did the line. If I, I just, that's my personal opinion. But I do love both pairs and I will wear both pairs. And they're really high-waisted. Like, they sit, like, like right above my hips. Because I hate when, like, high-waisted jeans say they're high-waisted. And then they come up to, like, here. They're basically mid-waist and they just lie to you. But these are perfect, super high. They come up literally like there's the smallest gap underneath my boobs, which I love. These will probably become, like, my go-to 
jeans i think very good from this pack and such good quality so thick you know not see-through at all you know when some denim can be like really flimsy and just like not warm do you know what i mean like scratchy these are super comfortable i could literally wear these all day like i'm super happy with the quality of them this wouldn't be one of my hauls if i didn't pick up some blazers because you know how i love my blazers and it's basically an autumn winter i was gonna say birthright but that's not that's not what i mean like an autumn winter way of passage to have as many blazers who humanly possible in your collection and this is what i'm achieving first thing i picked up was this cropped nude blazer which i actually love it's actually the perfect amount of cropped can you see this because i bought this blazer the other day and it was supposed to be cropped but it was like quarter length like it came up to about here and i'm like that's not cropped like that's just a weird length it looks like the blazer is too small on me but this is the perfect amount of crop i am super happy with it look it's this gorgeous like tan warm color which pretty much will go with every outfit like it pretty much goes with this outfit i'd wear this it's nice and it's not too dark it's nice and light you know you got your sands your beiges in there it doesn't have a button here which is annoying me because i want to wear i want a button here and then i want to wear like a cute bralette underneath or just like no bra well no i'd have to wear a cute bralette i have many ideas for my crop blazers i think i'm gonna dress these up this would look so cool with like leather trousers some cute heels and then yeah like i said like a skimpier bralette underneath or like very daytime like keep my jeans on even with like even actually if i was doing daytime i'd put this outfit on but then i'd put gray joggers on and then like big big chunky trainers or something but yeah really good quality super thick like super warm i love it it literally fits me perfectly i couldn't be more happy with this i hope this comes in other colors because i need to live my cropped blazer realness i do have a little bit of a fear of crop blazers i'm not gonna lie this is very much out of my comfort zone purely because like with a blazer i like to like I like it really oversized, so I like cover up a little bit and it like comes past my bum. And I feel very secure in a big blazer. This is a little bit more like, oh, stupid. This is just my train of thought. Like I'm, I'm just waffling, but I think it looks really cute. I need to branch out with our blazers a bit more this autumn winter. So this is what I'm doing. I'm on the jacket section. I'm going to do all my jackets and then I promise you I'll show you something else. But, oh my God, is that another fake leather blazer from Lydia oh my god shock horror whoa okay I look a bit like a detective <laughs> let me just sort myself out you know let's get get comfortable in it okay this is definitely yeah a leather blazer so now this is like a very light nude color I'd say I'd say this is stone so this is like a long blazer again it's a different shape to the other to the other jacket because the lapels it's not like a collar the lapels like come down by the side it's got two quite big side pockets and then it comes down again past my bum again it's fully lined it's so warm i actually have tried this on before and i was able to fit a jumper underneath this so i was like, extra toasty and extra cozy and i just think it looks cool i think it looks so expensive like this could be from zara or like this could literally I just think it looks so expensive the material looks so good look and it's the perfect oversized size do you know what i mean look if i could do that with a blazer then i class it as oversized it actually ever, why does everything go so perfectly with this outfit see this is your best like staple outfit for autumn winter because then you can literally put any jacket with it and dress it up anyhow you want and it still looks so cool so Definitely recommend these two pieces as your staple pieces and then get one of these pieces to dress it up. But yeah, I think I prefer this style way more than the black one because of, I just prefer this coloring. So the colors on that kind of remind me of just like a, I don't know, like a shirt, but it's a jacket. It's kind of confusing. So yeah, definitely prefer this one. Love it. Okay, this is more of a coat. I'm gonna call this a coat. Um, so you can't come for me oh i do love this one this is probably one of my favorite pieces i picked up okay so i want you to get the full force of this coat let me pan you down i'm gonna call this a trench coat and it's really big 
really oversized and like floaty. We definitely love the oversizedness. And then it's got two big pockets at the side. It's almost the same color as the other one. Like it is, I think it's a bit lighter than the other one. It's a bit more creamy than the other one. And this is again, fake leather because you know I love my fake leather. It's fully lined again, so it's super warm. It's super cozy. This literally feels like I'm wearing my dressing gown. Like I am so warm in this coat, you have no idea. Like I'd definitely be able to get away with jumper underneath this. Oh, you know what? I'd definitely get away with bare legs in this, for sure. It's that warm. And then because you know how it goes all the way down? Let me show you. Yeah, look, it goes all the way down to my calves. Um, it will keep my legs nice and toasty. Maybe this will be more of like an evening coat. Like if I wear like a nice like black slinky dress underneath this with heels. And then like check this on. And that's my vision for this dress. But I definitely kind of do. It can. It definitely does give me detective vibes, like Sherlock Holmes. Fucking hell. <laughs> like Sherlock Holmes. Has anyone watched Anoli yet? Oh my god. My mum texted me and she told me to watch it. Like I've never really liked Sherlock Holmes. I've never really watched it. Like I'm not like a big like Sherlock Holmes. Wow, I love it. But I was like, okay, I'm gonna give this a go because obviously Millie Bobby Brown is in it. Icon, love her. She's just so sweet. She just gives off the nicest energy. She's quite calming. Yeah, I love her. So I watched it. The best movie ever. It's on Netflix. Honestly, you have to watch it. It's not too, like, mystery. It's more about, like, her life. It's actually really cool. So I do advise you to watch that. Yeah, but every time I wear a trench coat, I always think of Sherlock Holmes. I'm literally just going to keep this top on the whole way through this video because it goes with every single item I picked up. These white ribbed leggings, they're actually so cute, high waisted and they've got like an elasticated band around here. I've actually seen these on probably every single person ever. So there's this girl that I love on Instagram, she, her name is Sophia. I always see her in these trousers and of course she's always tagging Miss Pap. And they look so cool. She's paired them with like blazers, uh, trench coats. She's even just like dressed them down with like a big hoodie and chunky trainers, which I love. Of course, I had to try them out for myself. They are a thinner material, but I'm not complaining because they are so comfy. And they don't have a cuff at the bottom, but you can like roll them up and they don't move. But this is how long they are on me because I hate when leggings go all bunchy around your ankle drives me crazy don't even small people problems but these are perfect and i'm so in love with them i will definitely pair these with like a big oversized jumper even this outfit with like a big blazer and chunky trainers you know what would look good with these i actually wore these out the other day these are also from miss pap okay oh god i always ramble on about instagram and other influencers because I'm just so inspired at the moment with all the autumn winter stuff going on. Um, Prada have some amazing chunky trainers. Like, they are gorgeous. They're not the ones I tried on in LA. They're different ones. These are white ones. And I was like, I want them so bad, but obviously I can't justify that much money on... I can't justify that much money on some chunky trainers. So, I picked up some dupes from Miss Pack. And these are actually the perfect chunky trainers. Oh, here we go. Here they are, they're really chunky, really thick sole, and then it's got some detailing here, which is like, you know that like mesh fishnet material, but they are so cute, and I love these because they give me probably like an inch or two more of height, and they're actually super comfy, and they look cool. I wore these actually on my recent Instagram, go and have a look, they just look so expensive. And such good quality. I also picked up the same leggings in this like blue, yeah, like muted blue colour. They are adorable. It's like dusty blue, this, isn't it? Definitely need to add some more colour into my wardrobe because all I seem to be going for is all white outfits. And I'm like, all white? Like, it's supposed to be all winter. Like, get your fucking colours in there, hon. But again, I got these in a size 10 and they are ribbed. What I specifically like about them is I see the actual pattern of it, them when they're on me. But look, here, they almost look like, you know, like the boy boxer design. Like, you know, when they're like, look, there's like a crotch down to the seam and then there's two seams running all the way through, which just look cool because boy boxers are the, probably the best things ever. They are so comfy 
and so are these they're kind of giving me like that sort of vibe just love this style so much i was obsessed with it i picked them up in the short version uh in the white ones which almost act like cycling shorts i think i'd wear this big oversized blazer big jumper or maybe with that big long trench coat because they don't keep my legs warm but even as like cute bed shorts you know like running around the house like doing my cleaning or doing my washing i'd put these on because it's the exact same material this like super soft rib material with the elastic band so they are so comfy and i got a size 10 again in these and look how elasticated that is whoa so i could either like size down in these because of that elasticated waistband okay the last thing i picked up was this white dress okay this dress looks quite dramatic i had big plans for this dress this was like for nice dinner i definitely wear this in the evening with some like cute heels i just love the style of this i just thought it was going to be so flattering it is kind of giving me like victorian vibes because this top it looks like a blouse and these shoulders are really wide and pretty so look this is the style of the top it's like plain here and then got like two ruched paneling it's got ruched arms which i love i love the puffy sleeves I just think they're so cute and then it comes down it's all ruched down here and then these ties I mean you can tie it oh I've just I've just undone that great you can tie it you can adjust it and just alter it to your body which is ideal this is definitely a more dramatic evening dress to be fair you could get away with this in the day if you were going for nice lunch I'd probably dress this up with knee high boots or just like biker boots but my idea behind this was i was going to pair them with these little heels which are adorable look they've got like a little that's not that's not even a bow but look they've got like a little tie here so i love that creasing that detailing looks so expensive it is fake leather so thick and then it's just got this heel and then a big block heel which are so much easier to walk in as i said in my previous haul and they go perfectly because these are not like white these are more like off-white almost very light stone so it's not like all oh, too white you're so you know it's so bright these just like move the outfit down a little bit so i love this you know we've got to dress up as much as we can at the moment so this is the ideal outfit for it okay this concludes my miss pat haul i am so excited to wear these pieces out and like style them with different things dress them up dress them down I'm so excited for autumn winter fashion. You have no idea. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.